There's something quintessential about pickup trucks that a lot of other countries simply don't have. They're American. Even when they're not American, they feel American. Ladies and gentlemen, let me introduce you to the best-selling pickup truck in America for the last 300 million years. All right, not that long, but at least 25. This is the F-150. And to make matters even better, this is the new twin turbo 360 horsepower monster. Not only does it get better gas mileage than the V8 equivalent, it also drives like a sedan, which is why this is my favorite pickup in America. Pickup trucks are amazing vehicles. They're incredibly utilitarian. They represent something that can do just about everything. At the fast lane car, we want to see what they're like to drive every day because flash that's what people do with them they drive them every day as their everyday cars and yes this particular one which is a brand new chevy silverado 2500 hd has a 6.6 .6 liter massive diesel engine that can pull up to 20,000 pounds you're not going to be doing that every day Ah, oh, I see you brought a cannon to a gunfight, Nathan. <laughs> and it ain't great. Uh, this thing is a turbo diesel, exactly what you want when you're way up at this altitude. Well, this is a twin turbo gas V6 that gets better power and better gas mileage than the equivalent eight cylinder. 6.6 .6 liters, Nathan. That is almost twice as big as mine. Oh, and yours is so cute and smiling. I just want to pinch it and go, you so cute. So which one of these is better? Mine. Mine. I think I have a way of figuring this out. Um, three challenges. Three challenges on how we actually use these things, not towing some massive trailer or anything like that. No, 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 no. How they drive every day. All right, I am up for three challenges as long as they represent the way that people actually use these. Okay, so how about comfort? Done. Um, how about ease of use? Ease of use, I like that. And a drag race. We always do a drag ah, race. Ah, but a drag race you haven't seen yet. So, Nathan, uh, what is this bucket for that's going to leak water all over me? <laughs> well, it, um, it has a line, and it's going to sit in the back of the truck, and as we drive around with the truck, the water's going to splash out a little bit, and based on which truck is bouncier in the back, uh, more water will come out, and we'll be able to judge which one has a better ride. Ah, uh, the comfort challenge, but I've got a better idea, Nathan. Nathan's idea is a good one, but I've improved it because it wouldn't be fair if he drove the truck. No, 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 no. I've got a better place for him. This is a stupid idea. So, how fast should I accelerate? I know. Pretty darn fast. <laughs> Just nice and easy. No, nice and easy. Oh, no. Oh. I do believe we've lost some water. <laughs> ah! Oh. Ah! Ah! No! Ah! Cold! <laughs> uh oh, here comes a turn. Should I take this nice and easy or should I make it rough? Oh, we'll take it very, very rough, of course. Please don't spill anymore. <laughs> Oh, that's down the sock. Oh, yes. <laughs> Better slow down. There's kids here. Oh, I'd hate to have any water spill out slowing down like that. That would be just so bad. Nathan, how much water did we lose? It was a stupid test. We lost two inches. Two inches, huh? Yeah, now it's your turn. Uh, not so funny. Not so funny. 
On second thought, this was not such a good idea after all. No, it wasn't. Yeah, go slow. Just really slow, Nathan. Ah! Oh my God. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> It's a residential neighborhood. There are kids here. <laughs> I am running the same loop that Roman ran, and I'm doing it at the same speed. <laughs> Turn coming up. There's a turn. God help us. Oh, no. oh God! Oh, it's cold. Oh, that is cold. Nathan, I feel like I'm back in kindergarten, and I just had a very serious accident. <laughs> but the verdict is yes. No, uh, it's about three inches. I think you wanted. You yeah, added. <laughs> I think there's a way I can. Uh, no, 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 no. <laughs> I won't do that. So what's the next challenge? The next challenge is what I like to call the happy challenge. It actually shows the usability of these trucks because of the height and lift over getting things into them. We're using the dog happy to demonstrate. Good girl happy. I get it Nathan. So a lot of people bring their dogs in the back of the pickup truck so you want to see how easy it is to get the dog in the back. Happy, that's come right. Here. Come here. That's Let's why we call it the happy come test because come on, come on. that's happy the wonder oh, dog. Yes, 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 yes. Oh look at that. You like the pickup, don't you? You like it. That was easy, Nathan. No problem. Did you like it, Happy? Oh, yeah, she liked it. She liked it. Good girl. Okay, uh, mine's a... My... Let's, uh, let's get this done. Come on, come on, Happy. There we go. Off you go. All right, go to Nathan. Go hey, to Nathan. Hey, Happy. 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 Oh, All right. there's your sweetie. There's my sweetie. Yes, you are. Let's make it easy. Come on, let's get in the truck. Let's get in the truck, sweetie. Up, oh, no, she... I know it's it's it, it, it looks higher. It's not. It <laughs> it's higher. I don't think she wants to go in your truck. You know what? Let's just uh, Roman wins. All right, Nathan. I have a good feeling about this. It's all tied up one to one, and I have a twin turbo that is going to kick that Chevy's butt. No, 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 no. No, because this is not that type of drag race. What do you mean? What kind of a drag race is it? You'll see. I feel like I peed my pants, and now I think I'm gonna poop my pants. I'm glad this race is only 20 feet. This is a proper drag race. It's good. At least this is completely green race. But I can tell I'm catching up. As a matter of fact, I think I'm gonna win this because he's completely stopped. Nathan, are you okay? This wasn't a very good idea for a drag race. <laughs> As always, this is Roman Micah and my cohort in crime, Nathan Adlin, reporting for the Fast Lane Car. Whoa! See you guys next time.